Several months ago, protests broke out in Ukraine. Russian troops marched into the country, a president was ousted, and gas prices exploded. Recall how you felt when this story first broke and as it developed. Were you ever lost or confused? Did you ever feel like you should know what was going on, but you didn't quite understand it? Many news consumers we interviewed feel confused by stories like this. If they don't follow a developing story right from the beginning, they find it hard to catch up later. They feel lost, lose interest, and give up. Who hasn't felt that way? Whether it's a war, the financial crisis, a political scandal, most people don't have time to learn every new detail of a story and understand the context behind it. And existing news formats don't always help. Take the classical article format. Every time there's a new development, journalists like us heard a whole new story. It's static and linear, a closed container that reflects the limits of print. So, how might we reimagine the article for the digital age? Imagine exploring a story in any direction, not just following the path defined for you by an article and its editor. Imagine you could enter a story from the beginning, the middle, or the end, with no repetitive or unnecessary information. Imagine accessing only the kinds of information that matter to you. Imagine the possibilities. This is Martin, an investigative editor from Austria, who's focusing on digital newsroom innovation. And this is Alexa, an accomplished newsroom leader, focusing on new revenue models for journalism. As Knight Fellows at Stanford, we've been using the principles of design thinking and user-centered innovation to reimagine the news. We want to help people understand complex stories better by breaking the article up into small, meaningful pieces of information, which we call atoms, we can create new possibilities for storytelling. Our prototype is OnRamp. It's our vision for helping people access the information superhighway. And here's how it works. Think of atoms like Legos. Each Lego block consists of a quote, a sentence, a photo, or a video clip. Each is meaningful on its own, but it also fits into a larger stream of atoms that make up a story. We can take atoms from existing news stories and rearrange them into overview stories. This way we can tailor stories to your needs and your interests. Imagine, for example, an atomized story about Russian politics. In the middle, you might find an atom with a quote by Vladimir Putin. Clicking on it takes you to our story stream about the Ukraine crisis. And from there, you might create a new story stream about Putin's obsession with showing off his raw power. In this case, an atom is worth a thousand words. Users can also embed atoms into their own blog posts, and by that, create new story streams. But that's only the beginning. Atomization can change the way we produce, consume, and understand the news. By atomizing the article, we can make breaking news stories truly digital. We can create a future of reporting, reading, and structuring information. A future where users come first. Check out onramp.it and join us in revolutionizing the news, because this is your onramp. Thank you.